My true Yarens, I stand before you armed with truth. For too long, our country was stolen by politicians. But you elected a vision, a cure, a road to paradise. Viviro, created by our own brilliant scientists, the most effective treatment for cancer the world has ever seen, grown within our precious tobacco, modified with the purest fertilizer, Viviro, is the key to rebuild paradise. But our paradise comes at a cost. This our enemies will never understand. Yara did not elect me to do what's easy, but to do what's right. And so, with renewed focus, I must extend the draft to paradise. True Yarans from across our island Chosen to produce enough Vibiro to heal the world and save our country. These lucky Yarans will be chosen by random lottery. Even my own son Diego will be drafted tomorrow. Hey Danny. And like a true Yaran, he Turn will that serve shit off. with a smile on his face. Precisamente. Exactly what Castillo wants. Enough politics, Lita. You think the draft is only taking true Yarans? It's the outcasts, the poor, orphans like us. He's bringing slavery back from the dead. In Yara, you can't run from this. Hang on, you ditched us. Ran off to the jungle with a bunch of guerrillas. Libertad. Hmm? Now you're back here to recruit for Clara Garcia's local crusade? Come on, this is our big goodbye. Danny, fucking say something. I got my name wrong. Danny, you could help Libertad. You're trained. Would have been career military if you weren't such a fuck up. <laughs> Just come with us, Lita. Aye. You never fucking listen, Danny. Hey, time to go. Boat's waiting. Drinks in Mexico. Dinner in Miami. Coño! Fucking blackout. Too big for a blackout. Fucking packet? Oh yeah! What's going on? Draftees must report for duty. You will join us to rebuild 
Okay, Danny. When we get to Miami, we say goodbye to Alejo. I promise. Open up. This is the end. Donio, get down. There's nobody here. Abre la puerta ahora. The door is Danny Rojas. Come on. FND, get out here. We're looking for Danny Rojas. This way. Okay, okay. I'm not resisting. I'm not resisting. Uh, what the fuck? Come on. I have a family. Wait. Don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot. Seven Revolution. Recognize the markings. Yeah, from when we were kids. You think you can? Please, no! This is so fucked. You have to come here. I can prove you to the sewer. Eighteen, I'll pull it up. Sergeant, do what you have to do. I'm 
boat's there. The way out is up ahead. Good. That boat's not going to wait for us. Letting the military kill us? These are the police, Dan. La noche de la muerte. The boat's over there! Run! Shit. Keep moving, Lita. We're almost there. with baseball cards. Do you have any idea what these are worth? Let us through. Oh, yeah. Mierda! Marco, always making new friends. Danny, you're late. Where's Alejo? Give up his sticky. For his family. Oh, shit. Alejo is an orphan. Alejo's not going anywhere anymore. Come on, Marco. Let them on. Vamos. Good man. Get on the boxing gal! Gracias. Don't worry about it, Chimaco. Here. That's all I've got. This isn't right, Danny. We should be fighting, not running to the Yankees. Alejo gave you a fucking gift, Lita. We survive. Same as the orphanage, same as the academy. What's that? No, no, no. This is a fishing boat. You're real. No, no. <laughs> was El Presidente. Mi papa loved to fish. We would go out on a boat 
just like this. And we would catch the fish and then release them. He would say, it's not always about your stomach, mijo. It's about the challenge. Except when he caught a big, fat, juicy marlin. <laughs> he was too proud to let that fish go. Sick, tirano! You have poisoned Yara! You have poisoned your soul! I have caught a very big fish today. Haven't I, Diego? Diego! No way. I have caught you, mijo. Now it's time to bring you home. I don't want this anymore, Papa. We have no choice. Let them go. They can work. Make vivido. Truth or lies? Truth. They could be good workers. They could help rebuild paradise. But if you wanted them to live, you would have never set foot on this fucking boat. 13 years old. And Diego has such compassion for his people. These fish? We will catch and release. What the hell just happened? I think we're fucked. Vamos, vamos! I can't feel my legs. Fuck. This is all my fault. My phone. Yeah, forget it, Lita. My phone. This is the beach, Danny. It's fucking fate. What? She's hiding here. Clara. Libertad. Julio. Fuck. Julio. It's all here. Take my phone. Follow the code like when we were kids. Stop it, Lita. Just wait. I'll find help. No. You give her this. Clara will help you. Don't you get it? You're the lucky one, Danny. You're the lucky one. So many dead. Gone. I should look for supplies and get the fuck out of here. Shit. Pistols empty. Need to find that camp. How the fuck is he still working? The markings must be the call Lita was talking about. Lu 
Warmbar. Must be Liberta. Lo siento. Your family will probably never know what happened to you. Who's shooting? Better stay quiet. I swear, the Claren, the big smell. It stinks like an. Gone, a patrol. I can smell it on your clothes, your sweat. It's the stink of a traitor. All rotten <gasps> on the inside. How did I know you were scavenging for Liberta? I smelled it on you. That's why you died. Now I'm going to call this in. You? You're going to be slowly eaten, bit by bit, by the birds and the crabs. You're just meat to them. Okay. Yeah. This is Bravo 5. We're at the beach. Shot a Libertad cockroach. Any sign of Clara Garcia or Juan Cortez? I'm not that lucky. I want... Good night. I'm not the only one looking for Clara. What's this? Could be useful. Liberta, steal a boat, sell the fuck out of Yara. Oh, fuck. Bad time to be a guerrilla. Been a while since I used one of these. A dozen one visitors. Gonna show your face before you shoot me. I'm Danny, a friend of Lita. Silencio. You are the only survivor? Answer me. I said, are you the only survivor? Si. Lucky. Need to know the risks. That's all you have to say? You're here. That's what matters. Just a second, hermana. I'm getting the hell out of Yara. <laughs> but you're in my camp. I need a place to stay. A few days. Libertas no charity, hermano. Lita said you would help. Lita also said you weren't a pussy. Come mierda! You're an orphan, see? 
Funny how friends can be closer than family. Remember, Danny. Castillo has kept you an orphan. Why do you want to run? I watched Castillo order a whole boat of our people shot to death. Get as far away as you can from that psychopath. All of you. <laughs> when tyranny is law, revolution is order. Quoting Bolivar won't save you. It's Pedro Albizu. Gonna save Yara with library cards? I have a list. Free elections, free expression, free the outcasts. A Yara free of Castillos. Simple. Simple? Castillos got what? 300,000 troops? I count six burnt-out guerrillas and you with a bullet to the leg. You don't believe me? I'll show you. We launched an attack from our base to this island. It was a basic operation. Hit a Viviro tobacco plantation, snatch some fuel, and go home. But Castillo's forces were waiting. Got us down from 60 to 6. You need to get back to your base. Yes, but this island is surrounded by a blockade. We don't have boats, we don't have much gear. And we are not leaving until that Viviro plantation goes up in smoke. But we are guerrillas. We know this land inside out. You're already familiar with our guerrilla paths. They were built by the legends in 67. They're spread like a web across all of Yara. Now, they're ours. Guerrilla paths are good to ambush soldados or to hide if the army is on your back. They have caches that will help you survive. And all this is legit? This map is old as hell. Made for turistas, yeah, it's out of date, but you got the regions, municipalities, and landmarks of Yara. You'll get used to it. Now I need to call in some favors with the locals to get us a boat, and you need to go find me Juan Cortez. Who? Someone who can make one guerrilla fight like a thousand. You know I'm not a guerrilla, right? You tell Lita that. I'll give you food, a bed, even a goddamn boat to sail to the Yankees, but it's gonna cost you bullets and blood. You can shoot, so shoot. Settle in, and let me know when you want to pay your rent. Time to get to work. I attacked this archipelago with a man named Juan Cortez. He helped me build Libertad from the dirt. Juan's a spy master from the pre-Castillo days. Can build an ICBM from a goddamn ice cube tray. Pulled off ops for Espinosa, the KGB, then flipped to the CIA and Mossad for fun. Juan is my mentor. He's also unstable and an alcoholic. When shit went south, he was so embarrassed, he walked straight out of my camp. Castillo soldados would love nothing more than to capture a double agent like Cortez. I need him back with Libertad, Danny. He's done with us, but you're a fresh face. Take this earpiece. Juan made them for comms, then head to the village. If I were you, I would check the bar first. Get down to that village and bring me Cortez. I hope for your sake he's sober. the earpiece. Can you hear me okay? Loud and clear. This spy shit works, Clara. I'll give you that. Bien. Keep your gun holstered if you want to stay out of trouble. Especially in areas with a lot of soldados. Si. I got it. A sp <laughs> Danny. 
Johnny, how's the earpiece? Can you hear me okay? Loud and clear. This spy shit works, Clara. I'll give you that. Bien. Keep your gun holstered if you want to stay out of trouble. Especially in areas with a lot of soldados. See, si, I got it. A smart guerrilla picks their battles. Suerte. <laughs> I don't have them on me, senora. No. Hi. Hola. I find out you're lying to me, I pay them off. <laughs> Understand? <laughs> <laughs> Hola. Oye. That looks like a Juan. in the worst fucking cantina in Yara, or is it Colombia? Kirat, Chechnya. Leave the bottle. Let's work for you. De nada. Guapo, you listen. Rule 16. A guerrero's revolution never ends. Always another war, another cantina, another ugly bartender. Juan Cortez. What do you think gave it away, Wapo? This isn't a fucking zoo, abuelo. Clara sent me to find you. See, I learned long ago never to doubt her. You will too. Hey, I know you. Don't think so. Yeah, I know you. It's like I'm looking at a mirror, Wapo. What are you talking about? Those eyes, guerrilla. You got a taste. You convince yourself you're a hero, but you wake up a junkie, just like Juan Cortez. This is a fucking waste of time. Can you whistle? What? Nah, you can't whistle. Oh. A la pinga. You fucking rat. You're worth more dead anyway. What the fuck? See, Guapo is in love with you. And I ruined the only copy of my book. Bueno, mis socios, vámonos. Once again, we have outstayed our welcome. you, old man. Wapo wants to be your friend. Or maybe he just needs to take a dump. Only one way to find out. Vamos. Come on, let's get the fuck out of here.
Stop fucking around. We got business. I can tell you handled a gun before. Oh, no. What's your name? I need to Danny. leave this town. So Clara says you're a legend. Ex-KGB, ex-CIA. <laughs> I got more fucking exes than your porn search history. Some men, they break eggs for breakfast. But Juan Cortez, he breaks fucking countries. Hold up. New plan, Danny. Vamos. The plan is to go back to Clara's camp. Where the hell are we going now? See that smoke? That means the watchtower just got a supply drop with some of the rarest materials you'll find in Yara. And you are going to go get it. Now you want me to steal shit for you? Gunpowder and Supremo Bond. The Cerveza and Chaser of Resolver. I'm gonna teach you to make shit for weapons. Because making shit for weapons is cool. And it's rule number nine. Always use the right tool for the right job. You coming with me? Fuck no. You got Huapo. You can tear shit up with him. But if you want to be sneaky, leave him behind. That cutie loves to make a mess. At least you're here to help Huapo. <laughs> Weapon or not, the military will shoot me on sight here. Guess this could be useful. A special announcement from El Presidente Anton Castillo. What the hell are you going to do with this? More shit for one. This is more like it. Found all your shit, Juan. Good work, Danny. Now hurry up already. We need to get back to Clara's camp. That's what I've been saying. Okay, we got more than enough. Let's get the fuck out of here. So what's with all this junk? You building something? Patience, Danny. Rule number eight. A guerrilla knows how to wait, like a spider or a serial killer. So, how did you get to this godforsaken hellhole? I was on a refugee ship. We didn't get far. Yeah, yeah. And I came here on a chopper in our baby invasion of Santuario. Shot straight out of the goddamn sky. No, I mean, what's your story? The orphanage in Esperanza. Huh? Listen to Juan. The orphanage in Esperanza. Then the military. I'm no guerrilla. Just helping Clara out until she gets me off this island. Huh? Listen to Juan. Rule 20. Once a guerrilla, always a guerrilla. Enough with that shit. Too late. The horse is out of the barn, and now the fucking cocaine is all over the kids, Danny. There is no other option. America is my option. <laughs> Of course. And you think Americans want your Yaran blood? The American dream is for Americans, Dan. You don't quit, do you? Nope. Wapo hates quitters. Gone. If you two are so close, why is he following me? Wapo goes with those who need him most. Like those therapy dogs in your precious America. You can trust Wapo with your life. Yeah. Not sure I'm there yet. You got time. You said your chopper was shot down in the invasion. Can you fix it? So I can fly you to the Yankees? No, that's... It's grounded. But I'm working on it. Patience, Danny. Now it's time for Juan Cortez to show you how to make something out of nothing. Did I ever tell you rule number nine? <sighs> you just did. Always use the right tool for the right job. Words to live by. Okay.
How many others? The legend returns. The legend needs to piss, Hefa. Who's she? She was a journalist who dared call Anton Fascista. Now she's an outcast, a slave for his paradise. And she's not the only one, Danny. Time you learn about resolver, Danny. When I was six, I rigged my first bike with a chainsaw motor. The blockade means I have to resolver every day, Juan. Nah, that's survival. For a guerrilla, resolver isn't just making do with what you have. It's inflicting chaos with everything you've got. Keep talking. A guerrilla's best weapon is the workbench. Go ahead, Danny. Get cozy with it. Let's take a crack at those weapons. No offense, but your battle rifle is a little basic. Rule number nine. Always Sometimes I lie awake at night. Excellent, Danny. Now you can pop enemy flesh like a ripe watermelon. Okay, let's look at your other rifle. Let's say your target remembered to wear These their... rounds fly straight and true and go through Kevlar like shit through a goose. Nice! Now you got your own supply of high-velocity war crimes. Let's look at your attachments. Time to make your very first suppressor. This will turn a bang into a bang. See how easy that was? Now you can silently headshot your enemies like a real asshole. The workbench is your friend, Danny. A friend with benefits. Damn. Making shit is addictive. With that workbench, you can build a new Yara. Feel like taking Wapo for a walk? You give that crock a name. Shit. I finally see my vision through. You better be willing to die for our cause. Danny, I've got big plans for you. But first, I need you to get a thing for me. Now, I hear you ask, Juan, what is this thing you need? All you need to know is don't try to eat it, talk to it, or put it in your pants. But Juan, I hear you ask, where is this thing you need? Head for the radio tower and follow the trail north. It'll take you to an abandoned camp on the east side of the island. I can mark it on your map. You'll meet my contact there. She'll hook you up. And Danny, you pull this off, I'm gonna give you something for pulling me from the bottle. A little gift an old friend gave me for saving his life. Not that you saved my life, just... I get the fuck out of here. Easy as smoking a cigar on Sunday. Reading a horse since basic training. Danny, some tyranny 
101. Checkpoints lock down the movement of people across Yara and will shred your tires with goddamn road spikes. Well, unless you got a horse. See, I've been through enough of them in Esperanza. Clear the checkpoints, destroy the billboards, then watch Libertad rise from the ashes. Then this place has a statue room. Checkpoint is clear. Did that feel good? You earned some guerrilla karma today. Keep it up, Daddy. Huh? Be nice, horse. Ah. One, I found the tower. See, I'm on my way. Hola, horse. Ah, sí. You're okay. Vamos, vamos. Here comes trouble. Juan described you pretty well. My name is Raisa, and I'm going to be helping you steal shit from Castillo today. Are you going to tell me what I'm stealing? Depleted uranium. <laughs> Perdon. I thought you just said uranium. You heard me. Look, all I know is I burned my last contact in the army tracking it down for Juan. You ex-military? Isn't everybody? Okay. Just show me where it is. First, you take this parachute. Trust me, it can save your life. Now I'll take you to the old Spanish fort. They've got it locked up inside.
This is no place to stop. Conscript or volunteer? Conscript. My number came up, so I did my time. You? Volunteer. All I wanted to be was a soldier. You know, wear the uniform, serve my country. Found out the only kind of soldier Castillo wants is a blind fascist addicted to his every word. So now you're a traitor. Yeah, and I'm not the only one. There's a guard posted at the watchtower ahead. He's going to let us use it to scout out the fort. He can also give us useful info. What does he want from us? One, not to get his ass shot. So keep your gun holstered or he'll open fire. Two, a little bribe to these double agents will get us military intel. Right. No weapons. Pesos ready. There he is. Hope you got some pesos on you. You got something for me? Okay, check this out. Here's where you can find some weapons around here. Thanks. Sure. Whatever. Everyone's got their price. Not every soldier is a fanatic. Some are just trying to feed their families. Just remember to put the guns away before you approach them. Use your phone to scout out enemy soldiers and see their weaknesses. I bet Juan's already giving you his right tool for the right job, Doc. Where's the officer in charge? Alvarez has the key to the armory. Careful, Danny. He's higher rank. In Castillo's army, that means he's better trained, quicker with the trigger, and a tough motherfucker. This fort is the most protected base on the island. These soldiers have been issued with body armor and helmets. Nothing armor-piercing rounds can't handle. Use the workbench if you need to craft some, and then go snatch that uranium, Danny. That parachute I gave you could come in handy here. Just don't drop into the middle of the fort, okay? Watch out! They've called back their patrols! Yeah? You mean this wasn't everybody? Keep on them! Fucking truck!
Got the key to the armory. The armory! The uranium. Go your fucking uranium, Juan! Then get your ass back to me! Next time, the better... Juan! Juan! to know what he's going to do with it. If I know who 
one, you're about to get a fucked up surprise. See you back at camp. Careful with all that hardware. Oh, yeah, Juan. <laughs> this is Resolver, Danny. Depleted uranium. Soviets left these sexy byproducts of nuclear enrichment behind in the 80s. Yankees use it for tank armor and bullets. <laughs> Crazy assholes. Sounds dangerous. You'll be a fucking superhero, Danny. Lita and I used to sneak these into the orphanage. Essential reading while waiting to fuck up convoys in the mud. A guerrilla must be a sponge for inspiration. Okay. But what the hell is this? This... is a supremo. Looks like a rocket launcher. See? She does that too. One more thing. I want you to meet... Tostador. The two go together like fire and fury. I like how you reserve air, Juan. So do I. Hola. Y voila. Supremos are like a good lover, or a great sandwich. Are you just hungry, Juan? Yes, but I'm talking about layers, Danny. Head to the workbench and I'll show you. Supremos aren't just simple tools. Let's take a look at that Supremo. The special ingredient that makes this all happen is Supremo Bob. Pick a gadget, Danny. This is a safe space. There's no wrong answer here. Excellent. Now go talk to Clara. Time to give that Supremo a workout. Now go talk to Clara. Time to put that Supremo to use, guerrilla. Got nothing to say to you. a job for you. I don't need to tell you that Viviro is the lifeblood of Castillo's regime. He's built work camps to produce it all over Yara. These plantations use outcasts as slaves to grow the tobacco plants they turn into Viviro. These are our people, Danny. Beaten, tortured, sprayed by poison chemicals. There's a camp on this island. We tried to destroy it when we invaded. We failed. Now, we're going to finish the job. Julio is waiting for you at a nearby barn. Hit that slave camp hard. Suerte. Supremo. 
time for a test drive of that Supremo. Now if things get too heavy with the soldat... of that Supremo. Now if things get too heavy with the soldados, just pull the trigger. But one tiny, tiny thing you should know. Uh-huh. The Supremos are in an experimental phase. They need time to breathe after you use them. You know, so they don't overload and kill you. Could have told me before I strap one to my back. Just let that Supremo feed off the blood of your enemies. What? <laughs> You'll get it, Danny. <laughs> You'll get it. Movimiento, deliberate, listen. I'm not going to bullshit you. I wanted to do this alone, but Clara gave me an order. I can handle myself. Don't give a shit. So could Lita. She should be here right now, but instead I get you. And I'm supposed to be in Miami. But instead my two best friends are dead and I'm stuck here with you. So, truce? Enough talk. Step one, we hit the tobacco. Step two, we destroy their poison supply. Step three, we get the fuck out of there, and Castillo gets a nice pretty message from Libertad. Got it. Take this gear. It'll protect you from fire, and more importantly, Castillo's fucking poison. What are you waiting for? Get that gear on. Using the right protective gear in the right situation will keep you alive. Yeah, the right tool for the right job. 
Been hearing that a lot lately. Listen, Julio. Lita was like a sister to me. She shouldn't have been on that fucking boat. She died because of you, Rojas. No. Anton Castillo killed Lita. If I could change anything, it would be me dying on that beach. Lita was a better person than I could ever be. And if she loved you, well, that just says a lot about who you are. Enough. Look, if you and I are going to do this, you need to know about the poison. You mean that shit they spray on the leaves? Its real name is PG-240, but we call it the poison because it fucks up your system. Try not to breathe it or get it on your skin. It can make you go fucking crazy or sick, like deep down sick. And if that doesn't get you, the cancer that grows inside you will. Goño. So you're military. Marksman? Close us all? What's your thing? I'm good with guns. We get along. We'll start thinking. That gear I gave you was good for fire and poison, but guerrillas need gear that fits their style, no matter the situation, or they get themselves killed. This is a good place to scout it. Right behind you. Let's see what we're up against. Up here, Dali. See the Viviro tobacco and the yellow poison tanks? See. Si. Punch holes in the tanks to let the poison out into the air. Fun fact, poison and fire make a hell of a mix. Big boom. Same idea with the fumigators. They're hard to kill, but they can't take the heat. You've got a flamethrower. You've got that Supremo. Time to fuck up all this Viviro bullshit. You know... Lita and I had a ritual. Psych us up before battle. A song. Hit me. El movimiento de libertad. Oh, bella ciao, bella ciao. Bella ciao, ciao, ciao. <laughs> For Lita. For Lita. Let's make some chaos, Danny. <laughs> Looking for a fight? We'll burn this fucking place to the ground.
golpearme, a metrallarme. Oh, vela, chao, vela, chao, vela, chao, 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 con mi sonrisa ensangrentada, nuestra lucha continua. Y si me muero, ¡Rune! ¡Rune! Amigos, en
burning sheet with a flamethrower? Felt familiar. Hey. Shit. You really can hold your own. I don't want to say I told you so, but... Look, we should move. That was a hell of a light show, and they're going to see the smoke. We work well together. See, si. Listen, if you are good with Lita, you're good with me. Gracias, Danny. Meet you back at camp. Oye, Clara, I hope you can see the smoke from where you are. You struck a blow against Castillo today. I hope Julio wasn't too rough on you. He's hurting, but okay. I think Lita would be smiling right now. Danny, there's someone I want you to meet. His name is Benito. He's a local fisherman, which means votes for Libertad. He lives on the east side of Casas Cove. <laughs> Always got time to make new friends. You're building bridges for me, Danny. It's your gift. We need Benito. Talk to him. Come on, this way. Clara Garcia talked you into this. She even had us fishers hooked on her Libertad nonsense. Convinced us to help her little invasion of Santuario. Lost five of my best. Now Clara calls me begging for boats, more recruits. Pfft. I'm a pirate first, fisher second. Thank the blockade for that. We use our boats to pull fish from the sea, and we get people and contraband past the army. But El Presidente died in his grip. The new Comandante, Rosario, has locked down all the fuel to keep it out of Libertad's hands. Murders anyone who dares get near it. Clara wants us to help Libertad? Take back that refueling station. Kill Rosario. Help put food back on our tables. Suerte, compay. Oh. 
Right. You want me to steal one? Been doing that since I was a kid. You're in the big leagues now. You need a car? Just call for one. I'll have a friend bring it right to you. Gracias. But you don't have any friends, Juan. Just shut up and call for a car, Danny.
Don't fuck with Sorry, this. Sorry, Guapo. No crocs allowed. Juan, this is a nice car. That's not a car, Danny. That is a 1956 Pullman Valentina. She's a work of art. Just like me. Except I don't have a ram welded to my chassis to fuck up anyone who gets in your way. You're definitely one of them.